But it is the final of Peaky Blinders this weekend. And Lizzie and Tommy Shelby's relationship could be in even more trouble if last week's episode is anything to go by. Natasha O'Keefe, who plays Lizzie Shelby, and Amber Anderson, who plays Diana Mitford, join me now. I'm obsessed, <laughs> and I can't believe it's going to be the last one. It was my mum got me into it. My mum got me into it, Amber. She was like, you've got to watch this. So I've been binging it over oh, the past really? couple of, well, past three weeks. Yeah. And here we are at the end. How are you no. feeling about it? I'm feeling relieved that I'm not the most hated woman in England. <laughs> um, she's vile. She's vile. Based she's... on a real true person who is also vile. But who's she's... also vile. Yes. But fun to play. Of course. Very fun to play. And, I mean, it doesn't look like it, but I do get on very well with the other cast members. And, yeah, I just I feel so lucky to be in the show. Oh, it's such a special such show. an exciting, you know, moment. It really is. And, and Natasha, you have obviously been in this from the very, very start. I don't think we've seen a character change so much as Lizzie. And what I love about the show is there are really strong, strong women in there as well as the strong men. Oh, yeah. Strong women folded in, for sure. I mean, it's also... Um, they're, they're women with that are multifaceted and got layers and they're not going to roll over and be tickled um so it's it's been a joy to play Lizzie Stark now Lizzie Shelby um it's been a real journey and um yeah I'm so so lucky it was each year it was kind of like a new surprise for me to see what um what Stephen Knight had sure. uh had written for her. <laughs> I think as well at the beginning of the last series, um, the way that you paid tribute to the late great Helen McGrory was was so fitting. It was just done so oh. beautifully. I mean, we we miss that character. Everybody misses everybody who knows what and loves woman. her misses her so much. But that was done so yeah. well. Yeah, um, I'm so glad you said that. And that's the kind of I think across the board that's how it's been received. So so glad. Um, you know, we've missed her immensely. She, you know, she she was the she was a real piece of the jigsaw that was totally missing this year. But um, she's so beautiful. Um, but yeah, so hopefully that that first series there um, was did, did some service and, and honoured her as best we could. It really did. It um, absolutely did. Yeah, really sorely missed. Absolutely. And and Amber, this, the thing about Peaky Blinders that works really well is this blending of real characters mm. with these fictitious characters that actually mm -hmm. we come to know and sometimes love, <laughs> just, just about yourselves. <laughs> but the casting is extraordinary as yeah. well, isn't it? I mean, you've yeah. been working with some incredible actors and actresses. Oh, my God. And actors who I'd looked up to since I was a young actor, you yeah. know, starting out and auditioning. And people like Killian, who I, I'd always seen as someone who I'd just kill to work with. And then to finally have that opportunity was he is amazing. brilliant. And Tom Hardy. I know, although I didn't get to meet him. I so. think he is my favourite, actually. Really? I think so. Yeah. Just because, he's yeah, great he's, he's, this there's something actually weirdly endearing about him, even though he is the worst. <laughs> yeah. And that's the thing yeah. about it. They're all awful. Yes. You know, in their own way, they're all awful. Yeah. But actually, they've always got some endearing qualities. Yeah. And that's what makes you, you're just drawn in. Yeah. It's all so, so stylish. I mean, you, you must yeah. have... A, it's a complete transformation know, for you into this woman. isn't it? I know, and honestly, all we really did was bleach my eyebrows, because that's a wig, oh. and everything else is pretty much just my face. Yeah. And then we bleached my eyebrows, so in the evenings in the hotel, I looked kind of insane. <laughs> I had this hair <laughs> with, like, ginger blonde eyebrows. How weird. I know. That's really extraordinary. But it was, yeah. What was, what was incredible as well, and, and I guess, you know, this is something I, I, I think that all of us really notice with this series. Uh, Natasha, it's, it's the stylishness of it, down to everything, you know, absolutely having the attention to detail, but just the music, the, the slow mos, the, the smoke, the fire. Everything, everything sort of, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I am a fan of the show without, you know, being in it or whatever. And whenever I'm in it, obviously, I'm like doing, looking at it through this kind of a, <laughs> this kind of way. But, um, it, you know, I would watch it even if I wasn't in it sort of thing. The music, like you say, the look of it, um, all the characters so well thought of and written, the writing obviously is at the core of it. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's, it's been, it's been a, a really great, great show, isn't it? It has. I, I wonder how, yeah, I don't want you to tell me, well. 
anything about the ending because obviously we'll be watching that <laughs> on, on Sunday to find out what happens. I just hope that everything is sort of tied up a little bit. But having said that, there are rumours, are there no, Amber? There might be a movie. <laughs> yeah. What do we think? I think? Are we all up for it? I, oh, my God. I would love to be <laughs> asked, of course. But I don't think anyone really knows anything about that it. That would be great. I know. Because it is It'll like be a film. Yeah, when you yeah, watch yeah. it, it is like a movie. I just yeah. can't believe I'm so late to the party that it's taken me till this year <laughs> to get yeah. into Peaky Blinders. Thank you, yeah. Mum. That was, that was all I can say. It is fantastic. We're going to obviously be watching... On on, on Sunday, yeah. BBC One, nine o'clock. Mm -hmm. It's the it's it's so sad that it's the end. I know. But if you haven't watched it, for goodness sake, start binging now. Yeah. Start binging now because it is extraordinary. Great yeah. to be part of. Yeah, amazing to be Great part to of. Be part of. And the episode on Sunday as well is is a feature length episode. <gasps> Is so we get, I think it's 81 minutes rather than 60 minutes. So I think, Excellent. I think the fans will be pleased to have oh, a little bit of extra peak. That because we need we need more. Yeah, we need more peak. <laughs> Thank you both so much. Great to talk to both Thank of you. you. Thank you ever so much. And for everything that you Thank have you. done on Peaky Blinders, you two are. Well, I don't, I don't think Lizzie's horrid at all. I actually really like Lizzie, but Diana <laughs> is oh, she's awful. Just <laughs> she is the worst. <laughs> don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.